I'm just gonna mow a little bit with this IH 1300 mower to show you what it'll do. And I'm gonna try to tape it. Fortunately, he's better with a mower than I am with a camera. I'll pause while he gets back to where he wants to start again. Here we go up the hill. You can see it's bringing that grass down just like you want it to. Trying to follow him, follow him with the zoom so I won't shake the camera as much. It's doing its thing. There you see it. It's not a representative mower. It's the mower you'll be bidding on. Now he's got it going down the hill. The car just follows the terrain and it just lays that grass down smooth as can be. And I'm going to sign off here for J&C Farm Equipment. Thanks for watching. My wife, Cynthia, and me operate J&C Farm Equipment. Been selling on eBay since 05. We put out several of these sucker bar mowers. I rebuild them myself. Like fooling with them. Had a lot of satisfied customers with them. This one today is my personal preference. It's a 1300 International. And I'll start down here on the hitch end. They'll hook up to most any three point hitch. I recommend at least a 30 horse. This one's this one's the one that has the Hitch your catches on the drawbar. There's two models of them. One has a cable goes over here, one has this. <laughs> and then you can lift your chain anywhere you want to, for wherever you want your bar lifted up. Spring air floats the thing in coordinates with these, this linkage here. I put a new belt on this one. I check the belts if they're cracking, I just replace them. Then the customer's in a better situation than I am too. Okay, there's a, it's got a good skit shoe on it. It's international, okay. This thing here they call a wing. It's supposed to help about keeping the grass clogging up here. That's new. Your sickle sections, a lot of people call them blades. These things here, it's 20, eight of them they uh, are new just a little bit of demonstrating all it's been done with them your wire plates these things are under here the circle bar runs on you can't see them there's seven of them they're all new and you've got your hold downs this is what keeps it in place these things here they're new. And all your guards are double. They're brand new. They always send these out with the ledger plates that starts your mowing process. There's one here on this shoe. There's one up here on this shoe. If those things are wore out, you'll have nothing but a headache. These are new. All the guards, everywhere it's needed, it's put on with lock nuts, your shoes and like that, because you put them on regular nuts, vibration of the mower shakes them right off. But the lock nuts keep them in place. Yep. Okay, then I decided to bolt this sickle in. It's a bolted sickle. Sometimes I rivet them, sometimes I bolt them. People, a lot of people like bolted, so I decided to do this one bolted. Original IH grass board. It's this thing here. Some people call them a sloth board. The company calls them a grass board, so I'm going with grass board. 
and as you can see in the video the mowers they one shape it's ready to go all you got to do is go mow you don't have to wear it out with a headache you get these things you can't see what maintenance has been done mm -hmm. or what hasn't been done mostly what i do to them is just maintenance but these have got a lot this one's got a lot of acres on it before you're going to need maintenance again and it's just like with those wire plugs you can't see those if they're bad if they're running in i've seen plenty of them they bore them down and putting them into the bar there yeah that's doing that but that's, that's that mower's not going to do right but this mower's got new ones, so well, it is doing right. That's why I put right. new ones on it. Exactly. I put new parts on as I want to, as I think it would be in the benefit of the customer. The man you, that's going to use this mower. You send I it out. I want him to use it and be happy with it. I don't want him all mad at me. <laughs> <laughs> so, so I put these out in A1 shape. I designed it. Just like you'd want it if you were going to use it. Yep. Just like if you were going to use it or I was going to use it. That's mm -hmm. how I put these mowers together. Whether it be an international, John Deere, stay with us, watch the adventure. Well, I mean, uh, JNC, we used to be the adventure, but that's a whole other story. But now we're JNC Farm <laughs> Equipment. We're JNC Farm Equipment, so the search engines could find us. And I didn't get the camera on fast enough, but he's Jim. Yeah. <laughs> and. Stay with us. We're going to have several mowers through the season. We always do. And this is As a, I get them gone, gone through and ready for the public. <laughs> and this is definitely a nice international to start off the season. Yep. Oh, I forgot to talk about my experience. I say all this stuff, you know, so many years of experience and something mm -hmm. I can just claim about. Oh, oh, time gets away from me. Let me see, about 55, I guess. Mm hmm No, about 58 you, years of experience yeah, with sickle. sickle bars of one form or another. So I learned a little bit about them. And I started about 10 years old with them. And I'm 68 now, so that's... I'll give you an idea of 